Today we're going to learn how to play Guts. Guts is a game of high speed throw and catch where the offense is trying to throw the disc through the defensive line to score. The defense is trying to catch the disc before it hits the ground to prevent the offense from scoring. On defense, a team can try to bobble or tip a disc until caught. Catching results in no points for the offense and the player who catches the disc throws back. If the defense is unable to catch the disc cleanly, the result is a point for the offense and the player who touched it first is the return thrower. In most tournament formats, games are played to 21 points where the team must win by 2. During the game, teams switch ends every combined 11 points and substitutes are only allowed during switches. Rosters are typically limited to 6 or 7 players with 5 playing at a time. The playing field is 14 meters long and width is determined by the wingspan of the players. After a disc is thrown, the defense can ch chase down a disc wherever they have space. Let's talk about some defensive rules. Once the defense is set, the outside reach of both end players determines the outside of the throwing box. The vertical reach determines the top. More on this in a moment. Defensive players are only allowed to use one part of their body at a time to contact the disc. If at any point a player contacts the disc with two parts of their body, a trap is called. The trap results in an offensive point and the player who first contacted the disc throws back. The defense is free to use as many bobbles or tips to catch the disc as needed and can chase down the disc as long as space allows. How about some offensive rules? On offense, the thrower must remain behind the line until after the disc is released. Failure to do so results in a footfall, no point is awarded, and the defense chooses who throws back. Remember the box you referenced a minute ago? The offense must throw into the defense's reach. Any disc that hits the ground before the line is short, anything thrown outside the end player's is wide, and anything above a player's reach is high. Additionally, the thrower must throw the disc right side up. No vertical or upside down throws are allowed. Vertical is considered 90 degrees either way and anything in between. Right side up is considered 89 degrees either way and anything in between. Failure to throw a right side up disc or within the reach of the defense is considered a dump. A dump awards the defense a point and allows the defense to choose who throws back. The shot shown follows all rules and is not a dump. So what equipment are you going to need if you want to give Guts a try? First off, you'll need a 110 gram Guts Pro. We're happy to provide discs to new clubs. Check out our socials at the end of the video for contact info. Next, you'll need some paint or cones to mark off the lines for either team. That's all that's needed for essential equipment. However, many players choose to wear gloves. Some wear them on offense, defense, or both. The most common gloves are football receiver and batting gloves. We also recommend using proper footwear for your playing surface. Since these players are outside on grass, we recommend wearing Now you're ready to give it a try yourself. Thanks for checking out this USA Guts presentation. Make sure to connect with us on social media for tournament updates or if you'd like equipment to start your own Guts Club.